Do you ever feel like Adobe's interface is just trying way too hard? Well, I'm gonna show you why DaVinci Resolve's UI and their interface makes a lot more sense. I have used Premiere and After Effects for a very long time, uh, from 2010 to 2022, so I've used both. And while their tools are powerful most of the time, uh, their UI can be kind of confusing, kind of like piloting a spaceship with unlabeled buttons. While DaVinci Resolve is very streamlined. It's designed to keep what matters directly in front of you so there's no digging around. Let's talk tabs. In Adobe Premiere, everything is modular. You can drag windows around anywhere, resize endlessly, and very easily end up with a layout that looks like a broken puzzle. Now, here's DaVinci Resolve. You see up in the corner you have Media Pool, Effects, and over here in the other corner you have Inspector. Uh, your media pool is just your media pool, has all the items that you show. You want it to go away, you unclick it, you want it to pop back up, you click it again, and there it is, That that's it. Same goes for the effects. You want it there, you pop it up, that's it. Those buttons don't move, they stay exactly there. Same goes for the inspector, and in the inspector you'll find all kinds of tools. The problem is, in Adobe, you open up the effect controls, you drag it to a new spot, forget where you left it, or accidentally close it all together. It's flexible, but it's chaotic. DaVinci Resolve is just consistent. The UI doesn't try to reinvent itself every time you open it up. You, you don't have to play Tetris with your tools, it, it just works. And that means less time messing with your interface and more time creating. So if you're tired of chasing your tools around the screen and you're still using Adobe for some reason, give DaVinci Resolve a try. I promise you'll like it. And before I go, if you want to become a supporter of my channel, the link to the Patreon that I've made is now in the description of this video. Uh, you can also join by becoming a member directly on YouTube. Uh, you'll find that down below as well. Uh, and don't forget to subscribe to the channel if you learned anything, maybe seeing things from a different point of view, like the video, and uh, I'll see you in the next one. Thanks so much for watching.